from the newsroom. Bradley, I understand you spoke with Representative Pauli of Dothan. What is he basically focused on, uh, basically, right now? Well, my representative Lee says he's going to be carrying the COVID-19 passport bill in the House to try and get a resolution by the end of Monday. Monday is the last day of the Alabama legislative session, and there's still a lot to get done. Representative Paul Lee is hoping to get the passport immunization bill passed. It would prevent local and state government entities from requiring a passport or showing any sort of identification that you've had the COVID shot prior to doing business or receiving any benefits from those particular entities. He says the reason behind this is to make sure people will have access to going into a business to buy. He says this has been a major topic across the nation and he believes there will be a lot of support behind it. I think there will be support for this on both sides of the aisle by the Democrats and the Republicans. Um, it is something that they want to address as well. Lee says there will be a couple of amendments on it, like schools of institutions from kindergarten to college to still have vaccinations that have been required to still be required. Anything required prior to January 1st, 2021 will still be required. Unless there a uh, reason for uh, exemption, such as religious beliefs or either health reasons. So that will be in there. And then some clarification that this is for those that are customers going into a business. And Representative Lee told me he's made sure this will be one of the top discussions on the calendar for Monday, so it will be addressed. All right. Thank you so much, Bradley. Well, today the 